What's up guys, Bassmore back here again today. Today I wanna to go over a spinner bait that's gonna change the game for you. If you guys have never been to my channel before but you'd like some bass fishing, gear talk, and tackle reviews, please use that subscribe button below. Smash that bell icon so you get notified every time I release a video. All right, so without wasting any more time here, let's go over the Advantage Bay Company spinner bait. The spinner baits that Advantage makes are crucial. They use great hooks. They use the EFT technology, which is really good flash off of their blades. They use these Mustad hooks. If you guys can use the comments section below, let me know what is your favorite brand of spinner bait. When is your favorite time to throw them? My favorite time of the year to throw a spinner bait is definitely in the early spring. All right, so the first thing I want to touch on here is this, the blades that they use. They use this EFT, the extreme flash technology. You can see the pattern that's on these blades. When it goes underwater here, you can see how much flash that it gives off. You can get a ton of, a ton of different uh, blade combinations if you order right through their website. You can get the nickel and nickel, nickel and copper, copper and gold. There's a, there's a bunch of different uh, variations that you can customize as long as the colors on here too. The two that I have here, these are the double willows and this is a nickel and a copper. All of their colors have this EFT technology on it. So like I said, you're going to get the ultimate amount of flash on it as well. They use a nice, uh, it's a Mustang hook wire. It's a tough wire here, so it doesn't bend up easily on a hook set. These are hand-painted realistic shad heads, and these are with fl uh, flared double gill plates. Each one of them on all their baits have this red inside of it, make it look like a bleeding gill plate. It's really awesome looking underwater. It really attracts the fish here. Just like with their chatter baits here, they have these little pre-made trailers built in. It really helps with a lot of action. You, it still can hold any trailer that you want. It's got a nice hook keeper right here. It kind of keeps the bait stuck on there. It's pretty sharp. Same with their chatter bait. It's got the really good elastic band in here. It's not going to pop off after a couple fish, even if you try to slide down this entire skirt. They do make replacement skirts, but these things hold on pretty good. Skirt here is a 90 strand 100% silicone. It's got a lot of flare, a lot of action while it's in the water. It's real nice and it's got a good rubber feeling on it. They don't rip, they don't break very easily. Down to the hook here, you're still getting your same typical Advantage Bait Company Mustad hook. Great hooks, man. They're super sharp. They're going to pin you know, any kind of fish that you got hooked on here. They're not getting off. Everything on this wire here is all stainless steel. You don't have to worry about kind of anything rusting on you or anything. They have real nice barrel swivels here. It gives you nice action. Keeps the blade kind of nice and free. All right, so we've gone over everything that these Advantage bait companies have on these little spinner baits. Like I said, they've got a ton of action under the water here. They've got a great hook. Really awesome EFT technology on these blades. Give off a ton of flash. It's all stainless steel. Hand painted, you know, the 100% silicone rubber skirts. They've got, these are a must have in your tackle box. They come in all sorts of weight sizes. You can customize these things down to every little piece that you see here on their website. Perfect for the springtime when you're really chasing them giants that move up shallow right before they, you know, get up on their beds and stuff like that. They're loud. They push a ton of water. Smash that subscribe button. I really appreciate you guys taking the time to watch this video. Please use the like button. Let me know what you think in the comments section below. Thanks again. I'll catch you guys on the next one.